Today, I'm going to be showing you how to increase your FPS in-game while keeping your visibility and quality in Overwatch 2. This is a no BS tutorial, so let's get right into it. First, you're going to go to your video settings and you're going to go to the GPU and you're going to make sure that your GPU is selected. You're going to go to graphics API, make sure it's DirectX 11. You're going to want to make sure your display is set to full screen to reduce any input lag, that your monitor is selected and that your resolution is the native resolution of your monitor and the same hertz. So mine's 240 hertz, so I selected the 240 hertz option. And then the aspect ratio should be whatever your monitor is as well. Going down, your field of view should be turned all the way up for better visibility. Dynamic render scale should be turned off. DLSS super resolution, if you have DLSS, should be quality. If you have an AMD graphics card, then you will use FSR for the super resolution and select quality. The render scale just leave as automatic. The frame rate will be custom and you just want to uh, set it to as high as possible or to the frame rate of your or the or to the hertz of your monitor your v-sync should be turned off triple buffering should be turned off reduced buffering should be turned on nvidia reflex should be set to enabled plus boost and then the gamma correction contrast and brightness is really up to you moving on you're going to go to the graphics quality tab you're going to do graphics quality custom. Your high quality upscale or upsampling is going to be NVIDIA DLSS super resolution. Your texture quality is going to be medium. Your texture filter quality is going to be ultra 8x. Your local fog detail is going to be low, model detail low, shadow detail low, and then effects detail low. Your lighting quality you want to set to medium. Your refraction quality you want to set to low. Screenshot quality could be 1x. Ambient occlusion is off, dynamic reflections is off, local reflections is on, and damage effects is set to default. From there, there's a couple more things you can do. You can go to the gameplay tab, and then you can go to general, and you wanna make sure that you turn enable high precision mouse input on. This isn't really a quality or FPS thing, but it will make your mouse input much smoother and cleaner when you're playing. Moving down to the HUD section, you want to scroll down. You want to make sure that your opacity of your waypoints and respawn icon opacity is set to 33% versus the default, which is 100%. Moving on to the accessibility tab, you want to make sure you reduce camera shake. So turn it to reduced for camera shake, that your HUD shake is off and your reduce menu movement is on. These things can be distracting and will increase your visibility setting them this way. If you have any questions, drop them down below. If you enjoy no bullshit tutorials, drop a like. Peace out.